Over 2,500 years ago, the people of Greece put aside their weapons of war to compete in the Olympic Games. Their great tradition has influenced, if not created, the modern sport of track and field. Today, the sport unites people across all levels of society in every corner of the world. It's a sport for everyone, Olympians and everyday heroes. Welcome to the National Track and Field Hall of Fame. that demands precision, grit, and passion. Sport that tests your will and your abilities to overcome all odds. And for a few, it's crowned by a moment where no one has gone before. A new world record. It's you versus me, but mostly it's me versus myself. Some people are born with speed, power, and stamina. Such talents are only the start. Being a great athlete is about hard work and believing in yourself. The great distance runner Steve Prefontaine said, A lot of people run a race to see who's the fastest. I run to see who has the most guts. Harrison Diller was inspired to become a champion when he saw Jesse Owens return to Cleveland in triumph from the 1936 Olympics. Marion Jones became a champion after her thrill at viewing the 1984 Olympics in her hometown of Los Angeles. Not all of us can aspire that high. We can dream. And we can participate in the thrill of what is possible. 126 runners entered the first New York City Marathon in 1970. Today, more than 35,000 compete, and millions more line the course to cheer. Over 30 million Americans participate in some form of track and field. Whether athlete or enthusiast, what they share is a basic commitment to their health, to their fitness, to themselves. Track and field has also been a stage for athletes to challenge prejudice and inequality, helping pave the way for dynamic changes in society. Jesse Owens leading the way as African Americans win 11 medals in the 1936 Berlin Olympics. Tommy Smith and John Carlos raising their fist against racism in Mexico City. And Catherine Switzer overcoming physical intimidation as she breaks the Boston Marathon sex barrier. Americans all across our nation compete in track and field. From great arenas to country roads, from urban parks to indoor tracks. Right here at the Armory, the first indoor meets were held 90 years ago. Today, the Armory is once again a focal point for track and field. With the launch of the National Track and Field Hall of Fame, the Armory has become a place where we can come together to celebrate the rich tradition and support of our sport and discover greatness in our heroes and in ourselves. 